Hello, I hope you guys are all doing great. This is the nail art design we're going to be working on today. Let's get started. I'm going to begin by painting a French manicure using this acrylic paint by Apple Barrel and it's called Antique White. But remember you can also use white nail polish. This is the brush brand and size I'm going to be using to paint my French manicure. And this is what the tip looks like. I'm just going to begin painting my French manicure going straight across in a straight line. This is the brush brand and size I'm going to be using to paint my design and this is what the tip looks like. These are the three acrylic paint colors I'm going to be using for my design. The orange and the yellow are by Apple Barrel. The orange is called Neon Orange and the yellow one is called Yellow. Now for the pink one I'm going to be using the brand Americana and it's called Sizzling Pink. I'm going to begin by adding the orange color to the upper left corner of my nail in a rounded motion. Followed by this without cleaning my brush, I'm going to directly move into the orange color, just surpassing some of that yellow. The final color is going to be the pink one. And again, I didn't clean my brush before moving to this color. Now I'm just going to continue to stroke in a rounded motion so that you can see the transition of the color yellow all the way to the color pink. I'm going to do the same exact thing on the opposite side, starting with the yellow, followed by the orange color, and ending with the pink color, and just stroking those colors. Now, on my lower left corner, I'm going to do another half rounded shape, starting with the yellow, followed by the orange, and ending with the pink color. And I'm just stroking those colors in without cleaning my brush. Now it's time to outline each of these rounded shapes. I'm using a striper brush in a short size along with black acrylic paint. And I'm doing the same exact thing to the two upper cornered ones. Now on the third one I'm going to go under my French manicure and unite it to the lower half circle. And I'm just going to round it all the way around with this black acrylic paint, outlining it. Now I'm starting to outline my French manicure. I'm starting off in the corners and I want this line outline of my French manicure to be thicker. So I'm causing pressure to my brush as I go side to side rounding off this line. And I'm just uniting it to the side corner line that goes under the French manicure. It's time to fill in the area that doesn't have the white color over the side of my nail so it could all look nice and even. Followed by this, once your paint dries, it's time to paint your black lines. It's up to you to fill in this area however you'd like. You can even add black dots. It would look very fun as well, but I decided on the lines. You can paint them however you want. Here it looks like I painted a letter N, so just continue following this pattern or any one of your choice. Now using my striper brush, I'm going to add a white detail to each of my half circles. Now it's time to add a top coat. I'm doing this so that the side area could become sticky and I could place three crystals. The first two are crystals actually in a two millimeter size and the last one's a rhinestone in a one millimeter size. And that's it. Apply your top coat and your design is complete. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial and try out this nail art design using your favorite colors. Be safe and I'll see you next time. Bye!